Um, hello, I'm Frosty76201 here with another video review. Uh, we're actually going to take a break from the Cobra Commander thing because even that's driving me nuts. Um, today we're going to be uh, reviewing the um, Hall of Heroes Zartan. Um, there are base, there's a single pack one that came from the regular line, which is identical to this, so I will not be doing a double review. Um, because it's the exact same mold color skin, there's almost no differences uh, between this other than they've added a little more uh, detail on how they painted torso on this, uh, this little chest plate right here. Uh, this is removable. I tend not to do it though. Um, they added some like, you know, like this little light blue kind of wire brushing technique to the paint scheme, which, you know, gives it a detail. Um, Standard geo articulation here in the upper torso. Arms move out, bends at the elbows, rotates at the wrists. Um, this has the better T crotch instead of that diaper crotch that has been pretty prevalent in the series. Well, early on, anyway. So you get a, a, a greater range of motion in the legs. Move out, double hinge in the articulation. Angles move. Note, the uh, hood uh, has been molded on and glued to the head by the manufacturers. Uh, this looks pretty close to what the original um, Zartan look look. Um, if you uh, want to confirm this, you can go to yojo.com and you can look up in the figure archives. Um, it comes with a plethora of accessories. It comes with a knife right here that fits pretty snug right into this little sheath thing right there on his ankle. That's pretty standard. A sniper rifle. Looks like it'd be a pretty long uh, long range rifle with a uh, <gasps> kind of exaggerated scope going on there, but if this were a you know my real rifle, I would not be opposed to it. A backpack. This does open up like that, where he can store his disguises. He comes with three in the Hall of Heroes pack. Storm Shadows mask, I'm sorry that's a little bit blurry. The bearded man, uh, as of yet unidentified, this is what came with the uh, vintage Zartan back in the day. That was his one and only disguise. And the Colonel, no I say Colonel Hawk, he was a colonel before he was a general, originally. Me, on. Yeah. Okay. Can I drop that? And he comes with a small pistol. You can see that. So, a great plethora of uh, accessories. Also comes with the Hall of Heroes Gold nameplate. Now, I notice his actually says G.I. Joe as opposed to actually having the Cobra logo like they normally do. So, that's actually a bit odd. And, um... I don't know if that makes this one a variant or if this is if they're all like that, but this was the one I came with. Um, you'll also notice everything in this video is mirrored for some reason. I don't know how to correct that yet. I will discover it one of these days. I swear it. Um, another little short and sweet review. Uh, this is an internet exclusive. However, you might be able to find one at a Hastings video or any kind of specialty shop like that. Um, don't count on it. E you know. Hasbro, Toyshop.com, ToysRust.com, places like that. that those who are going to be the Internet places, um, internet dealers like that. That's where you're going to find it. If you saw the new movie, this is what he's really supposed to look like. Face paint, hood, great looking character. Uh, probably my favorite from the old cartoon. My favorite bad guy. Thank you, and uh, everyone have a good day.